the only thing I would say as far as advice about while you're here is try to stay somewhat close because I don't want to have to go chasing you down and trying to figure out where you're at. Uh, we might have to move for some reason really quickly. Uh, the weather can change really quick. So um, just sort of the best idea would be to basically just take a deep breath and calm down a bit and just watch the way the light changes the scene. And to take a good look around and just note everything you're seeing and even though you might not know the names of the plants you're seeing or might not know the names of the sounds of the birds you're hearing I would say just just try to take it all in and watch if there's a sudden gust of wind uh, try to pay attention to the sound of that uh, and, and what that does in the valley and um, you know you might be wondering who who lived here before because uh, obviously there have been there's uh, evidence of a lot of um, you can see around uh, the evidence of the different people who lived here what's interesting is they all spoke different languages they all had different intentions they all had different ways of living and sometimes separated by hundreds of years in between where maybe nobody was there or maybe very few people saw the place so when you look up and you see what you're seeing now you know, think about that think about who was here before what language they might have spoke of you know you know right now we have we have uh, rubber wheels you know we have um, things we can tread on uh, rubber soles on our shoes, sandwiches, and we have uh, bottled drinks and canned drinks, and you know we got here very comf comfortably. But the people who were here before, now obviously some of them were here to stay. You see, there's some of their structures around, and um, but you know others were nomadic. They came through, and this was a part of a cycle. Maybe it might have been every year or so, or every season, or every two years, or every three years. And so, you know, very different sort of ways of living. And you know, uh, there are so, there is some evidence of those cultures clashing here. Uh, further up, we can see um, some hardcore evidence of that. There's a graveyard up there and uh, a whole story behind all that. But anyway, welcome here. And, um, you know, it's beautiful here, but it's dangerous. So again, just, I'm gonna kind of step back and take in the scene myself. And if you have any questions or if there's anything that you're, you know, curious about, feel free, I'll, I'll just be off to the side near near that tree over there. Welcome again. Great to have you here.